Well, elementary students throughout the state gathered at the University of Iowa today to showcase their inventions. It's part of a program geared toward making people's lives easier. Fox 28 News reporter Mugo Digwe is here to explain how they're doing it. Mugo. Sadie, the event is called Invent Iowa, a UI program that encourages students to think creatively. They're asked to identify problems in their lives and then invent possible solutions. And the students today did just that. Ten-year-old Katie Kovacic's invention started with an everyday problem. Nobody in my family wanted to make coffee because they didn't want to go to the fridge and fill up the pot and fill up the coffee maker and then clean up all the mess. So she invented this easy fill solution. It's um, a water supply system made for co coffee makers, made from common parts you find in hardware stores. A water line attached to a coffee maker. I'm connecting this line from the coffee maker to the line that connects to the fridge. She's one of about 160 third to seventh graders who submitted their work to invent Iowa. Brady Pearson invented the hot dog roaster rack. It took me like a couple weeks to figure out how to build it and craft it. Abby McKnight invented the pack and track. It's this like candy and then device that will carry your fishing poles. And these ideas got them to the state competition. What's so cool about it is these are ideas that came from their own heads, problems that they addressed much like engineers in the real world have to deal with. Leon Leak says this event helps students hone their problem-solving skills. Many of these students that we've had in the past are in engineering programs now at one of the two universities. They're also practicing engineers all over the country. Proof these youngsters are big thinkers. Kids can do anything. The students who made it to today's state competition were awarded $100. The nine top inventors received $500 scholarships to the University of Iowa or Iowa State University. Kate and Brady each went home with scholarships. Mugo Odigwe, Fox 28 News.